Hey guys, my name's Triple, and today I am doing a video on the bridge. And today is going to be the day I do a high visual tips and tricks video. Uh, it's gonna be kind of low key. Is I'm just gonna be playing the bridge while I talk about it. It's not gonna be spatially specific on the, that's ba It's not gonna be specifically based on it the whole video like I'm not gonna be like I'm gonna talk about it then I'm gonna showcase it I'm just gonna be playing and then talk about it in the background so yeah welcome back to some more content I got wrecked right there but uh, yeah so basically the bridge if you don't know uh, for some reason you guys think I'm good I'm, I'm actually hacking this whole time and uh, yeah see uh, there you go there's the proof uh, but uh, <laughs> now nah, that weird hit the last was really weird but uh, anyways let's uh, go ahead and you know, after you think you hit them twice, they would knock, get knocked off the map like that, but they just don't. So you actually need to knock them off 14 times. I heard that's a magic number. Uh, but uh, yeah, so let's go into the first tip and trick, I guess. And that would have to be, oh my gosh, is if you can utilize the bow. I think that's, that's what this guy's doing. As you can see, he's utilizing the bow a lot. And that's the reason why I scored on him. No, I'm just <laughs> but if you utilize the bow right, you can get an easier combo. Like this guy's getting. But this just guy. This guy just feels like he has speed hacks. I don't know what it is. He just feels like he's speed hacking. It just feels like he's. Where do you, what what what? I can get under before he gets over. Dang it! Oh my gosh, this guy. Oh my gosh, I lagged back. That's that's not gonna help. Oh, if I get underneath. See, like, what is that hits? What are those hits? I don't get it. I just don't get it. <laughs> It's like it doesn't help with these tips and tricks video if the person's hacking. Like, what? Okay, this guy is super sketch. Like, what? What? Ha. That's what I call turning on my hacks. Okay, let's just go like this. Run away. Oh my gosh. Boom. I don't care. I don't even care. If he says lucky, no, it's not luck. Because you might be hacking. You probably are hacking. You might just be lag hacking. I don't know, but it's just I don't know. But it seems like it's hacking. But anyways, if you utilize the bow, thank goodness he left. Oh my gosh. Okay, that was just a warm up game since he was actually like decent or hacking. Either one. That was a warm up game. Now we're going to go to the real tips and tricks. But uh, going in at number one. <laughs> what is this top five? Let's play. Uh, top five. Let's play top five plays of the week. Utilizing the bow is a good strategy. Uh, if you can get to utilize, what is this guy doing? That's here's another tip and trick. If they just go over, you just go under. That's a great tactic in this game. If they start building up, just go underneath them. Unless they're like right here, and you go under, that's a horrible idea. That's why you keep the white line there. If he's right here, you go under. You should be getting in for the goal unless you screw up. If you are where we were just fighting, if you're right here don't do it because he's gonna score before you that's why the white lines there the white line is literally the way of life and nowadays it just seems like everybody's getting better at this game or and or hacking what is this okay like reach and hits in this game seem really weird but just like them hitting you alone just feels like they're hacking it's just i don't know what's up today maybe i just bad maybe i just haven't played in a while but uh yeah, the, that, those are kind of like tips one and two as we get the third goal there. But uh, yeah, I think my third tip would probably be play way more offense than defense. Some people, when I go into a game, I see them protect their base when they can, and I just say no to that. The pickaxe is efficiency too, hacker, and uh, so like if you defend. They're going to come back and just use their efficiency to pickaxe for what it's made for and break through your de defense in like 0.25 seconds and it's it's not going to be a fun day. So let's just knock you into the portal. There we go. And score our fifth goal. He's going to call us a hacker again and we're going to jump into a new game. <laughs> so uh, yeah, I mean the uh, tactics that I've done, that I've told about in this video I actually use personally like because they're, they're they're good tactics I, I, I like to consider them as tactics I mean they're a way of winning the game so isn't that a tactic I don't know what the official definition of tactic is in the def dictionary but 
if if that's not the if that's not the definition then I don't know what is. And that was a, an example of another tactic, which is the exact opposite of the second one I mentioned, going under if they go over, you go over if they just stand still. That's probably more of a priority than the first one. If you if they're just standing here and you have a chance to block them off like this, or just jump over you and lag back, that works too. If you have an opportunity to block them off like this, like say they're standing here and you just block them off like this, just build a bridge, like a two block thing like this, and just it basically do this just jump over and in and you get a free goal it, it, it's that simple when I first thought of a tics, tips and tricks video a ticks and tricks video <laughs> a ticks video yes ticks video I mean I am a pug I am a pug that this is another tap okay what did I just say can we rewind that what did I just say that was what Twin first thought of a tics, tips and tricks video. Twin first thought of a tics, tips and tricks video. Nani? Be better than the bad people. That that's a great tactic as well. Be better than the bad people. Oh, here's another tactic. Don't try and show off your bridge skills. I see this way too often. I'm gonna do it right here. I see this way too often. I hop into a game and all I see is. Oh, look at my look at my six speed bridge. Oh. oh, oh, oh. And then I just go underneath them, and then, it, can, could you represent me real quick? Yeah, they. I just go underneath them, and they just stand there while they're bridging, and I just, and I just score. And they're like, what? What? And, and don't, don't try and show off your bridge. It actually kind of helps if you think about it in the long run, but don't do it still. <laughs> see, it's bad luck. I missed that jump all because I built this bridge and used this bridge. And see that rage quit? This was all planned. This is all planned right here. After waiting 2.67 decades for a new game, we are in the final game here. And I think, oh my gosh, these, okay. I, I would like to think of that as a strategy if you can pull it off. Uh, oh, here we go with the uh, uh, ooh, up and over strategy again. Kind of, that's a semi up and over right there. Q, W, we're like speaking our own language. What? Oh, easy, get on my level. Get on my flipping. Wait. Uh, I guess that's kind of another tactic. Is if you can manage the CPS, just like butterfly or jitter click on the right mouse click or whatever your place block thing is, and just go ham when the game first starts. Because when you like. Another part about this game is just trying to find good momentum, and that if he go, if he scores right here, that was all because I when I fell in the void, it took ages for me to die. Um, what is he, What do you mean? What do you mean? You scored. Why are you mad? You scored. People these days. Oh my gosh. Finally, after a million decades, he finally jumped and gets the goal. Okay. See, this is another way of beating me. If you make this frustrates people because if you make what the heck if you make a bridge like this that annoys people because it's hard for them to like get the momentum and build their bridge back to how they want it so if basically it's like it's like asking for a mcdonald's burger and then taking it apart and rearranging it right in front of them they hate it it's it's exactly like that again he's trying to sing despacito Oh, let's go. So good. So good. Sign me a con. Oh, he survived. No, he survived. Oh, you made a mistake as soon as you went on the side part. Oh, that was a huge mistake by you. Let's go. But yeah, I mean, I don't really have many tips and tricks. I just play the game and I mean, I'm pretty good. Oh, well, come on. Can we just talk about this? Oh, the lag, the lag, use the lag, use the lag. That's another way. You can use the lag to your advantage, and you can use the lag to your disadvantage. That's a great way to win. Use the lag against you, beg. No. Oh, okay, we're good. We're good. Okay, I actually kind of want to win this game, because this guy, like, cheating? Recording? Why did I jump there? That was... <gasps> Yes, stay alive. It's a good idea. Yes. We have won. 
Yes, GG. That is a victory royale monkey. How did you know? Anyways, hope you enjoyed that little tips and tricks video. I guess it would be considered a tips and tricks video because I technically showed you ways to be better in the bridge because just way too many people I face, I go 5-0 and beat them. And they're like, hacker? And I just literally just press W, my sprint key, and jump. That, that's all I do. If this helped you, make sure to leave a like. And I might do more of the bridge stuff because I actually don't really see that many videos on the bridge and it's probably because it's a PTL dying game like all the other PTL games but I like it so yeah if you enjoy make sure to drop a like and subscribe if you are new and I will see you guys in the next video good day my laddies